Would you trust the groom to deliver a dream wedding? Someone like that is a ten. <clears throat> She's bigger than a ten. To come up with the right theme. We could for a car boot sale. Enough of my wedding. And get the bride to the church on time? I'd rather just stay in bed. Do yes. I like it? Do I look like I like it? Can these men give these women a day they'll never forget? Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Brand new Don't Tell the Bride, Tuesday at 9 on BBC3 TV. Mr Net, catch up with BBC iPlayer. From humble beginnings. Today's going to be the best day ever. A wrong kid died. Through the story of a lifetime. America's greatest musician. People are saying that your new music sounds a lot like Bob Dylan. Well, maybe Bob Dylan sounds a lot like me. We're big fans of your records, too. Huh? I'm a king. Look out! The Dewey Cox story. Walk home. We don't know this song. You just follow me. The program is the list of approved enhanced interrogation techniques. We heard everyone in Iraq is being treated as though they were enemy prisoners of war. We were told by CIA that there was no objection. In fact, that some members said, are you doing everything that you can? Welcome to BBC World News. I'm Zainab Badawi. I'm here in central Washington. Either side of me are the IMF and the World Bank. Some of the world's best economists work for you. Why didn't you work it out sooner? So they're letting you off the hook, you no, think? No, no, I'm just coming to a conclusion. Were you shocked? when you were indicted by the International Criminal Court. I've come to Sudan's National Museum to talk to its director, Hassan Ahmed, who's going to tell us more. <laughs> sure. For five years, Rochus Misch had special access to the Führer. Where Hitler went, Misch followed. In the Führer's entourage, strictly speaking, we were bodyguards. He is the last survivor of the bunker, the final witness of Hitler's downfall. The one to watch tonight. I saw your tickets. Where I go is none of your business. We'll be all right, just as long as we act like everything's normal. You need to get back in now. Roxy and Ronnie are doing a runner. EastEnders, tonight at 7.30 on BBC One. It was a message that we chose not to listen to because we were tone deaf to terrorism at the time. Patience has never been my strongest point. To spend 22 days in intensive care, 72 days in one room, I was tough. I've been the luckiest person in the world. The wild and lonely fastnet, so stately and so brave, so true an ocean sentinel to those upon the wave. The fastnet, the fastnet, among the breakers white. The fastnet, the fastnet, the good old fastnet light. Tell you how to drive a tank. You don't tell me how to decide about a boot. She never. She never. She never. It does appear, sir, that the problem lies with yes, the battery. It's a bit flat. The Armstrong and Miller Show coming soon to BBC One. Oh, thank God. For a minute there, I thought we were really in trouble.